In this video, I'm going to be trying to recreate Jennie from Blackpink's lifestyle. For those of you who don't know, Jennie is definitely one of my favorite K-pop idols. And I just love her fashion and her aura in general. So in this video, I'm going to be trying to recreate her outfits, what she eats, and her makeup. And all the outfits that I'm going to be showing in this video are sent from Fashion Chingu. And for those of you who don't know, Fashion Chingu is basically an online shopping site. And they have a bunch of replicas of K-pop idol outfits. They have so many different K-pop groups. So if you like K-pop or Korean fashion, definitely make sure to check out fashion chingul so yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get started so for the makeup i'm gonna try my best to recreate jenny's makeup style i'm gonna kind of use these pictures as reference for the makeup look i'm also wearing this top which is one of jenny's most iconic outfits i think this one would be really nice for trying to recreate jenny's eye look so I totally forgot to put some contacts in. I'm gonna do that right now and put these brown ones. Oh my god, my eyes hurt. So now I'm gonna be tight lining my eyes and I actually never do this, but I've noticed in Jenny's eye makeup that there is tight lining. So I'm gonna be using this like pencil liner. Now I'm going to add her mole that's below her brow. Okay, so I think I'm done my makeup. Here is a little close-up. Obviously, it doesn't really look like Jenny's makeup, but I tried my best. Next, I'm going to be recreating some of her iconic outfits. So this is the first outfit and it's Jenny's airport fashion. It's basically this checkered cardigan with the same checkered pattern with the tank top and then wide mom jeans. I also have a black handbag similar to Jenny's. So the second outfit is Jenny's daily look. She has an Instagram picture in this cardigan. So I'm gonna try to pose just like how she did in her Instagram picture. I have another Instagram daily look from Jenny. This green top that she wore also became super popular and trendy. I love this top because of the lace trimming here. Next I have this outfit and it is also another Instagram daily look from Jenny. In Korea they call it sabuk fashion which basically translates to daily look and we all know that Jenny's daily looks are super stylish and trendy. I'm actually so obsessed with this outfit because it's not something I would wear on a typical day. It's not really my type of fashion but it makes me feel so like stylish and chic. I'm only wearing a mask right now because she wore it in her Instagram picture. <laughs> I feel so stupid. For the next airport fashion look, we have this. Jenny had an exact Instagram picture in this outfit, so I tried to recreate it exactly. This bear hat, so many of you guys have asked me where I got it from because I've been wearing it out a lot in my past videos and my Instagram posts and stories. So it is from Fashion Chingu. Now we have more of her dressy looks and this one is one of my favorites. This is really pretty floral dress. I love the fit of this and it's just super flattering in general. For this outfit, I put my hair in braids because Jenny also had some braids in her hair and I feel like this dress just looks better when your hair is like tied up rather than having it down. But yeah, Jenny wore this outfit in an Instagram post. Now for stage outfits, I have this one. I'm not exactly sure which stage Jenny wore this, but it became one of like her iconic looks. It's so cute. For 
this stage outfit, I have this yellow top and it also became a really popular look of Jenny's. I tried my best to recreate the outfit. I'm sad because my bangs grew out and for this specific look, Jenny had bangs, but I tried my best. another stage outfit that Jenny wore. This one is a two-piece set. Now I have other outfits that are also from Fashion Chingu, but they aren't Jenny's outfits. Either way, I'm still gonna show them quickly because they're so cute. Starting off, I have this green set that Rose wore and I love it so much, but it's so tight on me because the sizing runs way too small. You're actually supposed to wear this inside, but I literally can't fit in it. So I just have to like button this up. I can't even lift my arm up or else I'll like flash everyone. <laughs> I also have another rosé outfit, this cute floral dress. And then I have this outfit which Lisa wore for a Love Sick Girls performance. I'm pretty sure it was Love Sick Girls. Next I have this outfit. For some reason on the site it says that Sana wore this cardigan but then Chizu wore this skirt so... This dress is what Winter from Espa wore. I've actually worn this dress in my past vlog and also in an Instagram picture. A lot of you guys asked where I got it from, so it is from Fashion Chingu. And I've noticed that Winter also paired it with a cardigan, so that's what I did here. Lastly, I have this fluffy jacket and it's so nice. I love it. This jacket is actually from True Beauty. The character Tula wore this. So for food, I did some research and what's most popular from Jenny's diet is her avocado salad. She usually has it for breakfast, but it is not the morning right now. It's literally 7 p.m. I was going to eat this for breakfast, but I was just too busy with my classes and we're renovating our kitchen right now. So I'm going to be eating like Jenny for dinner. I'm also wearing a cardigan that Jenny wore in one of her Instagram pictures super cute so this is what i have there's the avocado there's a lot of other stuff and i'm pretty sure jenny doesn't have her salad just like this but and then i don't have detox juice but i do have tomato juice i just blended up some tomatoes and honey and i know some people are going to come for me in the comments saying that's disgusting but tomato smoothies aren't actually that bad honestly this isn't like exactly jenny's diet but it's close enough and then i'm gonna spray i said spray oh my god and then i'm putting this for dressing Mmm, I really put avocados in my salad. It actually tastes really good. I feel so healthy right now because I never have like salad for dinner. For those of you who don't know, I've actually been to one of Blackpink's concerts, their 2019 world tour. And what's funny is that me and my friends made it into one of the Blackpink Diaries videos on their YouTube channel, which is still so crazy to me. I still think about that sometimes. I went to the Hamilton show and basically there were these like staff members They were just walking around the venue before the concert Me and my friends noticed that they had like a camera and a mic and they were like walking around interviewing people And they came up to us and interviewed us They gave me and my friends a mic and they just basically asked us questions about Blackpink like why do you like Blackpink? And then at the end they made us dance. They were like, oh, just dance to any Blackpink song, you know So we did the do 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 dance and what's so cool is that they only added three clips of people that they interviewed in the Blackpink Diaries video and it was Hamilton and I think Chicago's show combined I'll actually watch it right now <clears throat> but yeah, that's basically it mm. wow, the salad is actually so good this video is probably gonna be semi clickbait because I'm gonna name it like living like Jenny Kim for 24 hours which this is not living like her <laughs> Thank you. 